Next tonight, a former British soldier is denied planning to commit a terrorist attack in Nottingham. William Howitt told a jury that messages found on his phone were just drunken bravado. Well, the 27-year-old from West Bridgeford is accused of preparing to send a political message by burning down an alternative bookshop. Our social affairs correspondent Jeremy Ball reports. The court heard that a detailed plan to attack this bookshop was found on the former soldier's mobile phone, that he'd bought equipment to break in and to avoid getting caught, and that he'd also asked a contact for a gun for what he described as something politically driven and anti-Marxist. William Howitt's accused of targeting the Five Leaves bookshop to intimidate people with strongly opposing political views. The jury heard he researched a left-wing author with links to the store and that he praised Adolf Hitler and described himself as a neo-Nazi. William Howitt served in the Grenadier Guards, but he told the jury that after leaving one of the world's most famous regiments, he had an inferiority complex. He said a friend from the army laughed at him because he was working on construction sites and as he struggled with his mental health, he started drinking heavily and taking cocaine too. He told Birmingham Crown Court that made him angry and talkative and he sent messages including one false claim that he threw a bottle at a Black Lives Matter protester. He told the jury, I was trying to look tough. I was trying to portray myself as a hard nut. But William Howitt said that was simply bravado. He's denied a charge of preparing acts of terrorism. Jeremy Ball, BBC's Midlands Today, Nottingham.